What's going on Leaf Nation, it's Leaf here back again and welcome back to the channel. Today we're back with another NHL 23 video and today is a huge video as you could tell by the title, we pulled someone absolutely huge. So this footage was from my 15 hour charity live stream that I did on Friday, November 11th. If you guys donated to that, thank you guys very much. We ended up raising $415 to the Movember Foundation, which is amazing. So these clips, you're going to see that I'm different. I don't have chin hair anymore because we hit a goal. But in, this, uh, in, in these clips, I do have the hair there. So it's going to be weird. Anyways, this is for my charity live stream. And then afterwards, I'm going to show you guys uh, my team as I will be doing a November team update. So here's a clip of me pulling that absolutely huge card. We finally have enough to do an icon choice pack. 80 of these collectibles. We need a Gretzky or Lemieux. Simple, plain and simple. Just give it to me. Just, just, just. We need it. We need it badly. We need it absolutely just badly, all right? It's time. It is time. It's time for this pack. Give me a number here, chat. One to five. Someone. Three? All right, we're doing three. On the drop. Number three on the drop. Here we go. All right, it's not, it's not Gretzky or Lemieux. It's not Gretzky or Lemieux. It is Wendell Clark. I haven't met Wendell Clark. It's my buddy, Wendell Clark. Ugh, okay. All right. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. It's okay. We still got four choices. We still got four choices. Give me another number, chat. Four? Four it is. Number four. What's behind number four? Let's go! Let's go, KJ. Let's go! Oh my god, we got him. Chat, we got him. Chat, we got him. We got him. We got him. We did it. And thanks to my boy KJ calling the number two. Holy crap. The rest doesn't matter. Like, let's be honest. The rest doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We pulled Gretzky. Let's just get the other ones out of the way here. Here we go. Yeah, Kevin Lowe. I didn't even know this was a card. And number three, and the, or number two and number one. Brandon Shanahan, Marner fan, yes sir, big W. All right. Yeah, I think the easy choice is uh, Martin St. Louis. We actually got Gretzky. Oh my God, my team's gonna look so good now. All right, so now we upgrade the LA uh, Gretzky to the Edmonton one because the Edmonton one is the best version out of the three. There's an LA one, there's an Edmonton one, there's a Rangers one. We take them as an Edmonton Oiler yeah, so this card's insane. Like, if we look at the stats here, 92 speed, 93 endurance, 92 excel. His shot's unreal. 92 wrist shot power, 92 slash shot power, 93 accuracy, 93 accuracy. Like, crazy card. Oh, my goodness. And that is right, ladies and gentlemen. This is what my new team is looking like for the month of November. We've made some huge changes. That being Wayne Gretzky, man. So he's on the first line with Owen Nolan and Tavu Teravainen, man. This Wayne Gretzky card is absolutely insane. Um, he is so fast, has an amazing shot. The only thing, the only complaint that I have with Gretzky is he gets bumped off the puck easily, but at six feet, 185, what do you expect? His strength is also 83, so it's, it's a decent strength, um, but he is fast, man. He can blow by anyone. His shot's amazing. He's miles better than everyone else. Second line, Mitch Marner, Austin Matthews, and Jared McCann. So we always had Matthews from the start of the year. He's now up to an 87. Jared McCann, we ended up getting from doing all those objectives. So I ended up choosing him. And then we ended up buying Austin Matthews during my 15 hour live stream for 600K on the dot. And honestly, man, uh, it was hard to say no to that. So we got him for 600K. He's up to an 89. I've been loving his card um, a ton this year. 90 speed, 89 excel, an amazing shot. Um, very hard to knock off the puck. Uh, one of my favorite cards to use this year. And this line is just amazing. I love it. Uh, third line, we got Ovi, Dry Settle, and Kucherov. In all honesty, um, I got to get Dry Settle up to an 89 eventually. And to be honest, man, I think eventually I'm going to get rid of Ovechkin. I don't think I want to upgrade him up to an 88. I kind of just want to stick with about three to four power ups um, or X factors, anyways. Um, Ovi's been slow at an 85. I mean, you get him to an, an 87, 88 speed and 89, 88, he's still at an 88 speed. Um, I think eventually I am going to get rid of him. Uh, it is what it is. Fourth line, we got Peter Stastny, Crosby, who I pulled the other week 
and Mika Zibinijad, who, ended, uh, who I did end up making. Eventually, I want to get him up to an 89. This car looks absolutely insane, fully upgraded. At an 84, he's been unreal, so I can only imagine how good he would be at an 89. And then on defense, for the most part, it's looking the same. We've got Teppo Newmanen playing with Victor Hedman. Newmanen might be a new card um, that you guys haven't seen yet. So he's on the top pairing with Hedman. He, th this pairing has been amazing. They're two big bodies, but uh, Newmanen is a faster guy. So it helps uh, just kind of balance things out between him and Victor Hedman. Um, this second pairing, man. Uh, we pulled Kel McCarr on Friday, if you did watch that video. Kel McCarr is playing with Bone Byram, who is now up to an 86. Eventually, we can get him up to an 87 and 88 for free, doing those objectives. Um, Kel McCarr, unreal card. If you guys have the coins to buy him, I highly recommend. He is so fast, has an amazing shot, um, can poke the puck off of anyone. Like he, He's actually unreal, and he can actually body people too. Uh, so don't get it twisted. Even though he's 5'11", 187, he can lay the body. And then the third pairing being Rasmus Sandin and Adam Fox. I have Sandin there just because, you know, he's a Leaf. Eventually, I'll probably upgrade that too. Uh, and same with Fox. I mean, this pairing ain't the greatest. Probably my least favorite pairing on the team. Um, they're both really small, which doesn't uh, really help. They can get bodied off the puck easily. So you got to be really quick when they get the puck. And then in there, we got Jake Ottinger. I mean, he's been pretty good for us in 10 games played. Five wins, five losses, an 83 save percentage, which is, you know... It, it's not bad and this is one thing i didn't show last month when i showed you guys my team uh build for september but i'm gonna show you guys my ap maybe i did show this i don't know anyways with gretzky we have elite edges activated unstoppable force honestly those are two big ones that you want to have on him puck on a string is pretty useless to me in third eye i mean could be good but for two uh, i don't have the space for it we got owen nolan of course close quarters in all honesty i might deactivate it like when he's in close quarters it depends man it's not going in 100 percent of the time maybe not even 80 percent of the time so i might take it off of him but for now we have close quarters on owen nolan teppo newmanen uh, has shut down and stick him up two very good synergies to have for defenseman bone byram has wheels advanced agility speed and acceleration of course you want to have that on your defenseman uh we have nothing activated with leon big rig i do miss but honestly even without big rig and you're holding that puck um and shielding that puck He's still hard to knock off of the puck. Austin Matthews, nothing uh, going on him right now. Eventually, I would like shock and all. I'm not too sure, though. I don't really shoot much with a toe drag. And maybe make it snappy would be a good one. Honestly, could be one that we... Maybe if we get rid of close quarters, we put it on Matthews. Victor Hedman was shut down. Uh, just makes sense for a defenseman. Tavu Teravine and Elite Edges makes sense for a forward. And I think that is everyone that has an AP... Uh, activated in all honesty i'm kind of thinking of get rid of uh, getting rid of uh close quarters from owen nolan and putting uh, make it snappy uh for austin matthews maybe in reverse for teplo newman and honestly advanced speed and acceleration was skating backwards which would be pretty good because my defensemen do get caught pretty easily and then we have two left over to honestly give to anyone and then the final two we might just give to owen nolan snipe outstanding skill to settle pucks with advanced wrist shot accuracy and settle off pucks not too bad and now we're at 40 ability save those changes but honestly guys this team is absolutely insane there's not one card that i dislike on this team maybe other than obi just because he's slow but like i really enjoy the cards on this team anyways guys that is it for today's video if you guys did enjoy be sure to drop a like on it if you guys are new around here make sure to hit the subscribe button down below we're on the road to 5,000 subscribers if we can hit that before the new year that would be absolutely amazing again i want to thank everyone again if you guys did tune into the charity live stream and donated to a good cause uh you guys it warms my heart thank you guys so much for all the support you guys have been showing me um since the start of the year and guys let me know what your team's looking like down below if you guys have a uh nhl hot builder team link that you want to link in the comment section below i would love to look at them and maybe review some teams for a video but anyways guys that is it for today's video like i said thank you guys very much for watching and i'll talk to you guys later peace